What's up you guys and welcome back to my channel and if you're new hi I'm Sin and welcome to my channel. Number one, excuse the appearance, the lashes, I get my lashes done tomorrow and I'm going to put this wig on one of these days this week. Second, Logan's in the back so yeah I, I want to get this video out of the way while I have time but he ended up waking up from his nap and wants to be in the room with me so He's back there. If you hear baby noise, that's him. But we're jumping into another wig review. Today this wig is from, I think it's We Girl official store. So just to read the stats of the wig for you guys. This is a 13 by 6 HD transparent, wait no, actually a uh, HD wig, 30 inches, 250% density. And in total I paid $228 dollars and 78 cents it was 223.83 with 16.95 tax but then i also got off i got 12 dollars off during the sale that they had so this is the um the picture that they used to do the wig i just excuse my baby you know mom's out there you know what's going on let's just go ahead and and get it out the bag so again if you watched my other my other um review video yes it's open but it's only open so that i could have seen which wig was in which bag because i ordered a few wigs at one time so i only opened it to make sure that it was what which one it was so when you take it out the bag oh so they don't give they don't give you no type of gifts they don't give you nothing but the wig so this is the wig inside of the packaging and it has like stick or like a sticky note on it that tells you how to measure the, um, the length of the hair and and if you leave a five star review you get five dollars and that it is 30 inches <laughs> well okay so they do send you like an elastic band it looks like Look, it ain't nothing for me. Anyway. So they send you this. <laughs> Logan. <laughs> okay, that's it. They send you a cone to go in the bag. And I guess an elastic band that you can attach to your wig yourself. I like the kind where you can just clip it in there. But this is one you have to sew yourself. So let's just pull the wig out and see what it's it's feeling like so again this is a, supposed to be 30 inch 250 percent density deep wave wig i believe um did i read that well loose deep wave it's a loose deep wave so let's see because i'm i'm just hoping that it's not a like lace front where it's you know we're gonna see so we're gonna take the net off So, this is what it's looking like. I don't know if this is 30 inches. I don't. I don't know. Okay. So, the parting space is giving what I was hoping that it would give. It's not like a full 13 by 6, but again... I mean, I didn't expect that, but it is still a lot of part in space. So, that's definitely a plus. It's really soft. I feel like it's going to be super pretty. And we're going to go straight into, like, styling the wig. Um, I don't think this is HD. I did the same thing with the other wig where I was like, I don't think that it's HD lace. Um, I just know what kind of HD lace I'm used to. So, like, AliExpress HD lace isn't doing what I... Well, I ain't gonna say AliExpress. These few vendors that I've tried so far are not really giving HD lace. But, let's look at the knots. Um, the knots are semi-small, semi-medium, I would say. Like, they're not all small, but they're definitely not huge knots. It's the teensiest bit pre-plucked. Mm. As, 
as I'm running my fingers through it, it's not. Tangled. Hi guys. So I guess it's where he wants to be at. Anyway, so anyway, when I run my fingers through it, it's not giving any shed hair or anything. So that's a plus. I have to look back to see how long it took to come because I do not remember. But other than that, it's really nothing else. To say about the wig, we're going to get into bleaching it and stuff. I'll probably bleach it and stuff tonight so that I can do it tomorrow because I kind of want to do my hair before I have to work because I won't have time after that. So we're going to see what it gives. So far, I give it a, a 4 out of 5. I just still don't think. I don't know if this is 30 inches. You guys tell me. Let's get a thumbnail picture. <laughs> Okay. Okay, y'all. So I'm back. I done got my lashes done, my eyebrows done. So this is the wig. I done um, bleached the knot, washed it a little bit, and plucked it and hot combed it. So this is what she's looking like. I just do a real basic pluck. You know, just a real basic natural hair before I put it on my head and then if I want to go in and edit anything I do but this is what she's looking like um she might be 30 inches might be now when it was before I wet it no it was not giving it but it's giving it a little bit and for density in my opinion it's giving when it's wet I feel like it's giving 180 when it's poofed out it's giving a smooth 200 maybe. But I don't know, we'll see when I put it on. I'm trying to make a TikTok in the middle of me doing it. So check out my TikTok because I'm working on my TikTok. But yeah, let's just install it. Okay, so this is my bald cap. Yeah. So I think I'm getting a little better at doing bald caps. You know, it's not the best, but I'm getting better. So, okay. And so for to color or to, I guess, to tint my lace, I'm going to be using my Fenty Beauty Foundation. And this is in the shade 480. So. Recording live from Atlanta, Georgia. Georgia. <laughs> Alright y'all, so my camera died. So, while I was letting that battery recharge, I put the same foundation onto the lace and sprayed a little hairspray on it. Just to, I guess, set the makeup. Mm -hmm. But I'm about to try the wig on. Okay, y'all, I had to fix that with my lash. Okay, but anyway, so of course I'm gonna readjust it, you know, for my head and stuff. But for the most part, yeah, I think that's what we're gonna go with. Usually for my installs, I use my lace glue, but I do not know where it's at. So I'm going to use this glue. This is the Lace Grip Extreme Pink Limited Edition. And it's acting like it's trying to run out on me, so let's just hope it's not. And let's just get into this bald cap because it's definitely giving bald cap. But yeah, you guys, so I just put three layers of glue on. After I put the two layers of this, I believe, I found my other glue. So I did another two layers of my own glue as well. And so I'm just keep doing that until I got three layers of glue applied. Alright y'all so I let it dry to this point and this bottle cap is really giving. Okay so now I'm going to pull it down, press it into the glue and yeah and I'm going to cut the ear tabs off. Oh, and I found my glue. 
and then here as you guys can see I'm just putting some more glue towards the front because I put a lot of glue towards the back because one thing I learned if you want your wig to last you need to have a thick layer of glue like you need to put that glue on don't put no little skinny little stick of glue put that glue on but yeah I did that and I tied it down for a good little minute and now I'm just cutting the lace off with an eyebrow razor and y'all as I said this is not HD lace as they claim but the lace is giving like when I show you guys after I put this makeup on the lace is giving like just give it a second just give it a second okay giving like giving and yes I do agree and I do admit I do need to work a little bit more on my plucking but again I always say my plucking is kind of like the base when you put it on as you can see I'm gonna pluck it some more I'm gonna pluck for my baby hairs but I feel like you know I don't like to over pluck my wigs because I like my wigs to last that's just me but doing this I'm trying a new technique with using the flat iron to curl your baby hair and stuff so I can tell you I 10 out of 10 recommend it I definitely say that it helped me with my baby hair game because I'm not the best with baby hair which you guys will see but when I curled, I showed you guys my left side. And then I just went ahead and did my right side. When I tell you when I did my left side and I did no baby hairs, I was just like, oh, this is how they get in the curl and look like that. Like, just wait. Oh, yeah, and I got this from Walmart. It was like $21. Definitely worth it. Definitely a great investment, a great tool to add to your arsenal of things to do here with. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. But, yeah, just watch how I wave all these baby hairs. Like, look at it. Look how good they look. Just wait. Look at that. Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay and then i let this sit for a good little minute too and now i'm just going through and um wet in the hair and putting mousse on it now i will say at first i was thinking that this could not be no 30 inches but today as i'm doing this voiceover i wet the hair in the shower and combed it out and stuff and i will say that with it being wet and lengthened it do give more of a 30 inch like when it's wet fully like that but like drenched it do give a 30 inch look and as it dry of course you have shrinkage and stuff but y'all look at this giving scapiano giving yeah this came from out of my scalp <laughs> been growing my hair out for 12 years yes thank you <laughs> but yeah i definitely do enjoy this wig i definitely do enjoy it all right y'all so this is the final look i like it um i definitely don't think that this is hd lace but I think you you get what you pay for. So again, I'm not the best with baby hair, but I think I did pretty good. So yeah, the links to this hair will be down in the description box below if you would like to check it out. I give it a I give it a four out of five. Yeah, guys, let me know what you think. Check my video on, out over on TikTok. And hopefully, I will see you guys in my next video. This is Sin signing off. Seeing what the new hair do. Peace.